Hello and welcome to the MAC weather page for this Thursday, December 7th. And uh, first of all, I want to wish my youngest of four kids a happy birthday today. Jackson turns 12. And as far as the uh, weather headlines, we got a widespread snow event. We got snow showers coming up today, but a more widespread uh, event with the Clipper system that's looking more and more impressive on the model. So we're going to have to keep an eye on this. Right now, the thinking is that this system will bring a widespread one to four plus inches of snow across the entire area. And uh, my best guess is around two to four inches for much of the MAC and LAC areas. And as you get over towards uh, Nuevo and uh, 131, that area, I think you have a good chance of seeing between four and six inches. And again, that would be for Friday night, late Friday night into Saturday. Uh, so it could be a pretty slippery morning out there, but again, uh, for many people traveling uh, Saturday afternoon, heading south, once you get away from Lake Michigan, uh, overall, I shouldn't be too bad, but certainly a wintry scene uh, for the weekend. As far as the normals for today, our normal high is 35, the normal low is 22. You can see the record 61 degrees back in 1998, 0, 1936. And as far as precipitation yesterday, about a hundredth of an inch of precipitation. We'll call it a tenth of an inch of snow. Did have some snow on the windshield and uh, on some of the grassy areas this morning here. Again, overall in the rain gauges, and that'll be the case for much of this winter. Uh, you may see a lot of zeros out there, but uh, whenever we do get rain or we get melted precipitation, we'll certainly show this map. But again, not much in the way of precipitation until you get over towards the lake effect snow areas yesterday where they had quite a bit of snow. As far as temperatures out there this morning, temperatures with the cloud cover pretty uniform in the low to mid 20s. And we do got snow showers out about the area. And you can see that on radar as the lake effect bands really setting up nice across uh, Lake Superior down into uh, Northwest Lower Michigan. And this is the uh, front that's dropping through that's created a pretty good line of some snow showers. And we caught the tail end of that here in Brockenridge picking up a dusting uh, across the area. And if we look at the uh, forecast map for today, you can see that front dropping through the area and we'll have scattered snow showers here over the next 24 hours. But again, not a big deal for most areas until you get over towards the lake shore and up in the northwest lower Michigan. And then if we skip ahead to Saturday, you can see that system. Well, let's go back for a moment here. You can see the system that will be dropping out of Canada. It's going to come right down into lower Michigan as a clipper system. And again, that's going to bring a really good chance of snow as we get into uh, tomorrow night into Saturday. Behind it, more cold air will continue to funnel in, bringing more snow showers. Another weak system that could bring a pretty widespread area of uh, at least snow showers, maybe some light accumulations to much of the uh, MAC and LAC areas will come in on Monday. So again, plenty of snowfall here over the next uh, week to two weeks anyways, probably well beyond that as we just don't see much in the way of warm air anytime soon. As far as precipitation, this is over the next 84 hours or about three and a half days. You can see uh, many areas between two and three or maybe even four tenths of an inch of uh, uh, quantitative precipitation. Now we expect that snowfall ratios are gonna be around uh, maybe around 15, 16, 17 to 1. So you can figure about uh, 2 inches would equal 3 inches of snow. And if you get closer to 3 tenths, you could be up close to 5 inches of snow here. And that's over the next 4 days. So I think in general, 2 to 3, 2 to 4 inch snowfall is likely. And again, we're going to want to watch the uh, trend on the models to see if it increases in intensity like it has been. You can see the uh, WPC forecast over the next uh, 72 hours. They're probably... Uh, fairly confident of a lot of three and four inch snowfalls across the entire MAC and LAC area with heavier snows again in the lake effect snow regions. As far as the forecast goes for today, you can see uh, temperatures up around 30 and that's about as warm as it's going to get through most of the weekend with occasional snow showers and then that system again Friday night into Saturday about one to four plus inches. Another system on Monday into Tuesday could bring us some more light accumulations as well. And again, we may need some winter weather advisories for even the interior areas as we get to Friday night and Saturday. And we'll certainly track that uh, clipper system on the models as that will be the theme as uh, clipper systems and troughs will continue to pivot down into the area. As far as weather watch this morning, uh, these uh, lake effect snow advisories are continuing until about four o'clock this afternoon and winter storm warnings continue up into the uh, northwestern portions of lower Michigan and winter weather advisories also along the entire shoreline of the upper peninsula. Thanks for stopping by and have yourself a great day and 73s to all.